So here he is, John Bones Jones. Two brothers in the NFL, but none can lay claim to being the greatest of all time. Bones Jones can, still on the right side of 30. John Jones, back in 2011, became the youngest champion in UFC history. And to say he's still going strong would be an understatement. John Jones, the consensus greatest of all time, making the walk here tonight once again. John Jones, in my opinion, is the very best at utilizing his reach advantage. If you watch John's fights, he is the very best at keeping fighters where he can hit them, but they can't hit him. And if they get close enough to get a hold of him, he has some incredible wrestling talent to go with that striking. So an interesting stylistic clash in front of this young fighter here tonight. You gotta think he's trying to figure out how best to get this fight to the ground and use his ability to pass. This guy cuts the guard with the best of them. Great technique, but also a plus athlete. And he's not afraid to lean on that athleticism and do some unorthodox things to better position himself on the ground. This guy can keep a pace that very few human beings can match. His cardio is absolutely outstanding. the tape for this heavyweight fight. Well, how about the age discrepancy here? More than 15 years apart with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. All right, now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands by Pitana Jatal, weighing in at 219 pounds. Fighting out of New York, Monster! And when the action begins, our referee charge of the octagon is Dan Mergliata. So Dan Mergliata shares the cage. All right, are you ready? You ready? Let's go First round fight. underway. <laughs> Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Nice defense there, huge block. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. And he connects with the punch. Tagged him with a Superman punch. Certainly showing off some good hands here tonight. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe, and his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Oh! He's got hurt here. Oh, very nice. Try to establish that jab. Jones gets connected on it fiercely there by that overhand. Hey, he's got a nice snap to that leg kick. Very nice. Yeah. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Oh, that's as good a jab as you'll Oh, he heard him. Yeah, he left him. Wobbly on his feet. This could be it. Big shots. Oh. Superman punch. Clean, hard shot to the head with that hook. Oh! This could be it right here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. How about that shin? Nice leg kick. Jones gets the tight clinch here. This is a very good spot for him, Joe. 
Duffs that takedown attempt without issue. Good defense there. Under a minute now to go. That was a nice jab. Hit him hard with that hook. Huge uppercut misses. Oh, straight right. Woo! Woo! Look at that jab. Nice one, two there. Trying to establish right, that jab once again. The horn sounds for the end of round one. Let's see if we get a better look at that from this angle. Let's see it one more time. Finish the round. Nice. Way to go. Listen, you almost had him finished, but the round came at the end. Brittany Palmer doing fine work as usual. Absolutely insane. If this round gets off to anything like the last round, one of these guys is going out. I can't imagine a scenario where if they continue where they left off in the last round, that one of these guys doesn't get knocked out. That one hurt. Oh, he connects there. That's again the experience. Total strikes. Well, Joe, you gotta fault the strategy here. I'm not saying he bet on the opponent, but he's moving right into that straight punch and right into his opponent's striking range. He would be wise to get his head off of the center line and stop leaning in. Oh, straight to the body by Jones. He lands a Superman punch. Good uppercut attempt. Powerful leg kick. Big right hand. Oh, nice hook lands. Hard left hook. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Hook to the head there by Jones. Put him down. Now he goes for the single leg. Caught him with a punch. <laughs> keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Nice punch. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute, he did so there. He got tagged with that uppercut. And speed, man. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of it. Oh, nice knee. Oh, he is rocked right here. He's trying to stay up. Thirty seconds now to go in the round. Oh, he's hurt! No! He's out! That was excellent timing here to land a big left hand to stop the fight. Yeah, Joe, just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but I'll win for that fighter here tonight. And here we see it again. Oh, man. K.O. And there he is after the huge knockout turned in tonight. Near-perfect execution. 
and one of the bigger highlights of his UFC career. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliano has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 36 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by so there's the man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here tonight as he gets his hand raised and does so emphatically by way of the KO. Perhaps some bonus.